Hello everyone, welcome to a short tutorial on user equipment or UE. Looking back at the devices of the past, for the first and second generations, 1G and 2G, the devices we had were initially only for voice calling. Later on features such as SMS were introduced, but most phones like the brick phone on the left were designed only for voice calls and referred to as dumb phones. With 2G and GSM, feature phones such as the ones on the right were developed. These could do more than just voice calling. In fact, some could even send faxes. In standards, these dumb phones and feature phones were referred to as MS or mobile stations. Then from 3G onwards, mobile phones further evolved. Initially, they were feature phones, but more than just feature phones. First with the back, then front cameras. Then the iPhone was introduced, which was one of the first smartphones, along with the other initial Android phones. So this concept of mobile device was now a portable computer, far more advanced than a feature phone. They consist of two categories, smartphones and phablets, the big phones with much larger screens than previously seen. We also had another category of devices called communication devices. They supported connectivity between two devices or between the device and the internet. For example, the mobile data card, also referred to as PCM, CIA, hardly used anymore. More commonly, the USB dongle also provided connectivity and is widely used. Another category of device is the mobile Wi-Fi hotspot or MiFi. These have a SIM inside which create a Wi-Fi hotspot for many devices to camp on. Furthermore, we have mobile data devices such as tablets with seven inch screens or even larger used for accessing the internet, voice calls can also be made on these with the aid of a headset. All these different kinds of devices are referred to as user equipment or UE in 3G PP standards from 3G onwards and including 4G and even 5G. We have a number of new categories of UEs being introduced now, for example, connected cars, smartwatches, smart appliances, and even VR and AR headsets. Any of these gadgets, if they have a SIM to connect to the mobile network, they will be referred to as UE. If a smartwatch just uses Bluetooth to connect to your smartphone, then it is not a UE, but there are smartphones, there are smartwatches with SIM. Most gadgets do have a SIM, and many gadgets will soon have embedded SIM, making them all UE. I hope you found this short tutorial on UE useful. Any comments or feedback, please leave in the comment section. They will be very much appreciated. Thank you.